This is my new favorite way to eat cereal, and it's just one of the many new inventions that my product designers have cooked up in the second ever Crunch Lab Spinning Wheel Challenge. Today, I have $300 and a problem that needs solving, so of course, I'm calling in the Crunch Lab product designers. Hey guys. Okay, here's the deal. We're filming so many videos these days, I don't have time to eat. So now I need you guys to build me something where I can just be a lot more efficient when it comes to meal time. So you want speed. And efficiency. It needs to like go into my mouth nutritiously. How does something enter your mouth nutritiously? <laughs> I don't know. That's your problem to solve. And to help you do that, we have two spinning wheels. What you need to feed me and where you need to get it from. So there's three teams of two. First up, Bam and Stephen. Let's go, Stephen. Come on, come on. I'm confident. Oh, oh, yeah, cake. So for Bam and Stephen, they will go to the dollar store to get supplies in order to feed me cake. Wow. I don't like that. You literally get 100 items Thank to you. feed me cake. Jovan and Daniel, let's go. Oh, let's go. <laughs> Looks like Jovan and Dan will be headed to the hardware store, Harbor Freight, and their food is cereal. Oh. That's a good one. Do I get to choose the cereal? Uh, no. <laughs> <laughs> and finally, Adam and Danielle, let's go. And finally, Danielle and Adam's store will be Target. What? Oh, nice. And their food is spaghetti and meatballs. Yeah. I'm gonna get messy. We can do that. Spaghetti and meatballs? I'm wearing a white shirt. <laughs> this better be precision. No promises. Here's your $100. Again, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> better end this, Danielle. You Thank can't you. be trusted. And the winner of this competition is just the one that makes me feel something the most. Interpret that how you will. But the winner does get a Toyota. What? An actual a Toyota. Toyota. <laughs> yes. Why do you guys look like so Like a dis toy no one? Way. Get to work. All right, <laughs> All right. sure, Mark. It's an actual Toyota, but also like, keep your hopes kind of low. As the product designers got going on brainstorming their ideas, I was immediately concerned. This is Mark. Oh, the trick to drawing Mark is you just gotta have that. We have to give him muscles. So, yeah, that's Mark. And after nailing my likeness, they started to prototype inventions that would feed me food. I really like a ramp, honestly. So they can like <laughs> launch. <laughs> We got cereal. Harbor Freight needs a lot of power tools. Uh, Yo, leaf blower. <laughs> they were allowed to steal parts from Crunch Lab's build boxes and hack packs. Ooh, what if we use the Vortex cannon for blowing out oh, a candle? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I like that. So they grabbed as many as would be helpful. I mean, an obvious one for meatballs is a ball. Oh, direct hit. You could really get them going fast. Because the rest of their supplies Head out. that way would come from their $100 shopping spree. We're going on a field trip! Dog break, dog break. Turn Look the camera. Dog, 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 dog. I lost everything in my brain. Come on, lock in. All right, let's do it. Let's go. Let's go. I'm so excited. What is this? We, got, we definitely have to get the RC car. Wait, wait, wait. Elmo. How does Elmo relate to birthday cakes? While Bam and Stephen ransacked the dollar store, Danielle and Adam were off to Target. We need a ramp of some sort. Uh, I want it to like... Yeah, mm. like do some loopy loops. <laughs> yes. So maybe something like this. Mm. this. This is a big mm -hmm. part of our budget though. That one does four loops. How many loops are we gonna get out of our meatballs? <laughs> Jovan and Dan were discovering the joys of the hardware store. Oh, meatballs. Oh yeah. Three in one, dude. It can mulch too. What does that even mean? Could we mulch the cereal through <laughs> it? Oh, let's go, dude. Put it in the car. We're making this whole thing birthday themed. It's gonna be a whole experience. Happy okay. birthday, Mark. Doesn't this just scream Mark to you? Wait, do you remember he bought us toothbrush in the pumpkin video? Runners up, get toothbrushes. Dental hygiene is very important. We remember. Okay, we keep grudges. <laughs> Ooh, yeah. Look at this. Oh, the little tank is so this. cute. We can pour the sauce in it. We'll need to track down a clerk. Oh, the button for it. Right. <laughs> uh, Thank you. Thanks so much. We have a milk funnel. Stick this over the end of the leaf blower. And it's just like, <laughs> blah. Jovan. Little handheld belt sanders. Wait, that's perfect. Warrior. Ooh, have to get wings. <laughs> really? What's the price in it? A dollar fifty. This is the dollar store. Is the dog for sale for a dollar? We're gonna come back with the whole store. Fire extinguisher? I don't think that's for sale, man. <laughs> <laughs> Can we remove one item, please? With everybody checked out for less than $100... We may have been a dollar over. <laughs> <laughs> we can put the Twizzlers back. It's time for the teams to head back to Crunch Labs. We did it, we, we did, did it. it. Yeah. All right, let's do our unboxing. I think Mark's gonna appreciate the Hot Wheels. He did the longest Hot Wheels track, I think. And set an official new world record. But he didn't use the tracks to feed himself meatballs, so... Oh yeah. Mm, that's good. Oh yeah. We need more meatballs, I think. We're team fun size. This is our secret handshake. We're gonna win. With this. <laughs> yeah. So I think the first thing we need to do is we need to figure out how these cars work. 
<laughs> is that all it does? It doesn't drive? <laughs> That's all it does! We got bamboozled. <laughs> what are we doing with this? No one reads these. Oh, yeah, dude. <laughs> let's go. <laughs> this is gonna hey, be good. Let's do just a quick test. <laughs> <laughs> Honestly, disgusting. <laughs> <laughs> Almost none of it's gonna end up in his mouth. Now let's take a look at some of the hack packs and stuff. Speaking of hack packs, have you ever wondered what our Domino robot would look like with a pizza cutter attached to it? Because in that case, Adam and Danielle have got you covered. Oh, that's perfect. <laughs> Bam and Stephen were not quite as confident. Bam is working on the way we're gonna move the cake. <laughs> Behold, engineering. We need more duct tape. Imagine that, but with cake on it. So we find a way to mount the cake on label and then we can control exactly how it spins. We're thinking cake would rotate, scoop into the fork. <laughs> That's good. Closer, uh -huh. closer. <laughs> We went back to the drawing board a little bit. I got a laminar flow fountain here and Dan's got a turret. We actually designed these, which is super cool. Heck yeah! We're gonna like connect this mechanism to the top of a turret and have like, a fully remote control like stream of milk. <laughs> So gross! Oh, oh no! Not gonna lie, kind of intimidated. <laughs> yeah. By the way, if you love any of these toys and want to think like an engineer yourself, you can just visit crunchlabs.com with the parent. I feel ready to start putting this all together, I think. Let's do it. Do I look cool? Ah, sorry. Oh yeah, that's good. Great. Okay. <laughs> you want it even faster? I want it faster. <laughs> I feel like we've really captured the essence of cereal. And after three hours of working, Ooh. the time had finally come to see the results. Time up! Let's see what you got! Enchanté, Monsieur Robert. Oh, Robert, I like that. Is this some fine French cuisine from Harbor Freight? Yeah, mm -hmm. you could say so. First things first, safety. Safety, of course. I might also recommend that oh, you... Oh, ear protection. Um, I would put these in your nose. <laughs> wow. So we've prepared for you a three-course cereal experience here. Okay. For the first course, there will be cereal followed by milk followed by faster cereal. <laughs> Just like how they do it in France. A very nice use of the hack pat turret, by the way. Okay. Bon appetit. That means go. Here we go. Ah! Javon and Dan's Fruit Loopinator may appear to be just a box of cereal on a belt sander, but the small mass of cereal and the high speed of the belt sander made for the most intense meal of my life. It's good, but we are a little dry. Well, we got a solution for that. Oh, no. <laughs> No. For some reason, all the cameras stopped working at the exact same time. But needless to say, it was quite the experience. And as an engineer, I had some thoughts. Guys, I gotta say, I'm impressed. Open wide! <laughs> oh! <laughs> <laughs> I gotta say, I definitely feel something. I'll give you that. And I'm a little less hungry. Adam, Danielle, see if you yeah, can do better. I think better. we did a good job. Yeah, that went well. Wow, look at this. This is the Ready Spaghetti Meatball Machine. Wow. The meatballs do a really fun loop-de-loop -loop and then get accelerated <laughs> downwards oh, <laughs> into your no. mouth. I see a pizza cutter here. So after the meatball is accelerated uh, into your mouth. <laughs> Why are you laughing? <laughs> Roll it back. That was a laugh. <laughs> <laughs> Just so happy. Uh, There's a sensor here that will sense me ball going through. This is all autonomous. The meal comes to you. Okay, so that's the Domino robot from Hack Pack. We hacked it a little bit, and so now it'll progress. It'll cut the spaghetti, and then that'll fall into your mouth, of course. Why is there a water flosser here with spaghetti sauce? We heard that you like your sauce extra thin. Who did you hear that from? Word on the street. Okay. The Domino robot yeah. also figures this relay, which powers on the sauce dispenser. Wow. Well, since this is all being done in the name of efficiency so I can work faster. I'm just gonna fire off some emails here while I get my dinner. Oh man, why do you guys keep giving me safety glasses? Have you tested this? Um, all systems go. As I laid underneath this table, thinking through all the decisions in my life that had brought me to this point, I was struck by how proud I am of the product designers. But then I was struck by something else. Oh, mm. a meatball. 
<laughs> Followed by some pasta. Oh! <laughs> oh! And some very watery sauce. <laughs> oh! Wow! That was runny marinara sauce. The rumors are true. Uh, yeah, that works. Well done. I guess it's on to dessert. Whew. Hi, Mark. Hey, Mark. It's a little messy over at the spaghetti station. What do we have here? It's your birthday. Yeah. Guys. We have psychic powers. You shouldn't have. Yes. There's a lot of things here. You're going to put this on. Oh, This, I believe, is a dollar. Safety glasses. Oh, wow. Turn around. Oh, I love this. Last but not least. We have a little bib for you. Wow. And with this dope fit complete, I was finally ready to eat some cake. I want food. Feed me. Each of these candles is one of the letters of happy birthday. We're going to load the cake onto label, light a candle. It's going to drive forward. Blow me, bam! The candle will be blown out, so you don't have to do anything. Oh, I blew it out! Wait, I forgot to make a wish. It'll shovel it onto the duck game conveyor oh, belt. Oh, that's how this is gonna work. Here it comes, and you get the and you get the candle too. How's that taste? It tastes like wax. You might want to spit the candle out. <laughs> the next piece is coming in hot. Open Happy wide. Happy birthday to me. Oh yeah. Oh. I see that you stopped writing emails. I got so excited. Wow, that was a lot of cake. More? Aw, you guys. I'm gonna go brush my teeth and deliberate on the results. Nice. I think we did a good job. Okay, well given how clever all of the Crunch Labs build boxes are, I knew I could trust your guys' engineering skills, and I never liked this shirt anyways. Very impressive. As for the team that wins, a Toyota. I feel like you guys still don't believe me. This is an inflatable car. Does an inflatable car sound like this, man? This might be a real one. All right, well, the winner is... Is Bam is Stephen. Let's go! Oh, what? <laughs> and without further ado, you guys ready for a Toyota? Oh my god, oh, it's actually a car. That's a Toyota. I don't know what to drive. Oh, I need to learn to drive first. What? Oh. I got you <laughs> a Toyota. Mark. I got a Toyota. Oh, Mark. I knew this was too good to be true. Where are you guys going? Seriously, actually, actually, I'll take it. Oh. There you go. Hope that still means I'm her favorite boss. <laughs>